Though you want to know how to change a roll of toilet paper. You grew up with your parents changing the roll of toilet paper for you. But now since you're grown up and on your own, you don't know how to do this. There is many ways of changing the roll of toilet paper. One way is putting the new roll of toilet paper on top of the old roll. But this will just result of it falling off. It will go racing across the floor, making you waddle like a duck to chase it. Before we continue to change a roll of toilet paper, we need to take a history lesson of where toilet paper came from. In the beginning, our ancestors used to use their bare hands as toilet paper. This resulted in troubling times for them as eating and greeting other people would be messy. In the later years, our ancestors would use leaves as toilet paper, but this proved to be troubling as well, as some of the leaves they would use would be poisonous. In the more recent years, people used to use newspaper as toilet paper, but the newspaper companies caught on to this, so they started using a glossier finish or a waxy finish on their newspapers so people wouldn't use them to wipe the bums. This was especially troubling after a taco fest. Someone got the idea to take paper thin enough that would dissolve in water, cut it in sheets, and put it on the roll. And now we have a roll of toilet paper. So now let's look at some of the tools you will need to change a roll of toilet paper. A notebook with a pen and marker. A new roll of toilet paper and an old roll of toilet paper. A jar of mayonnaise and a can of tuna. Then you will need a mallet, including a piece of pipe and a tape measure of at least 15 foot. These are all the basic tools you will need to change a roll of toilet paper. If you do not have these, you will not be able to finish the task. This is where engineering and science comes together to form art. This is how the professionals do it. They make an art form out of changing toilet paper. If my calculations are correct, this will work the first try. This is where you push the new roll of toilet paper onto the old roll and you will have a new roll of toilet paper. And to finalize everything, I will now hammer with the mallet an old roll into the new roll to ensure that it is stable and sturdy and will hold up its strength. And now, for the tricky part, to make sure that the roller is loose and the old roll of toilet paper is loose as well. This will help make sure that the old roll of toilet paper comes off with ease. Now to double check our measurements to make sure everything's going to line up and everything's going to go together on the first try. So here's the moment of truth. Will everything line up? It looks like everything's lining up correctly. Now to the next part. This is where you can make or break. This is a very dangerous part as many people have lost fingers and have gone to the hospital while putting on the new roll of toilet paper. So I ask that you use caution when doing this.
and this can be a very frustrating time to finish everything up. But once you get this done, you have finally completed the task of changing a roll of toilet paper. Before we finish the video, I just want to point out there is two ways of finishing this task, and that is which direction the toilet paper faces. The first way is to have the toilet paper coming over the top, coming towards you. This is called facing you. This will be the most easiest way to get toilet paper. The other way is to have the toilet paper go away from you. This is called not facing you. This will cause a challenge when you need the toilet paper. It will soak up time and it will be troubling. If you're wondering why I'm doing this part outside, it's because ever since I changed the row of toilet paper, I've had a line of people waiting to use my bathroom. So now you know how to change a roll of toilet paper. Now you can go and tell your family and your friends that you are able to live out on your own. I hope you enjoyed this, as this was no easy task to change a roll of toilet paper. Come visit us at any time here at How To Maybe, a channel which will show you how to do simple tasks, but make it more difficult. If you like what you're seeing, please like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you'll be aware of our next video.